cool heating operating instructions to make sure that you are getting the most heat out of it. We wrote down the instructions on the unit itself. The most important thing is when the cool heat is fired up and running, verify that you have a call. Aquastat has the red light on and that you have flame. As long as you have flame, the pool heat is working. Now, in order to make sure it's running correctly, we must make sure that our inlet temperature is at least 110 degrees or higher. If we look at our gauge, right now we are at about 112, 114. Now, if it's too low, if the pool temperature is too low, you have three valves. The middle valve is the balancing valve. If it's too low, open it up more. Opening up the balancing valve will cause the temperature to increase. Now, if we look back here, we're getting about 100, we're getting closer to 120. Now, we want to get as much hot water from here into the swimming pool. So, if it's too above 110 or 115 degrees, close this. A small rotation of, you know, uh, one twelfth of a turn will cause a big difference. So go slowly, wait a minute, and then check it. So from opening it up fully, we shot up to 130. Now by closing it a little bit, we are now dropping the temperature back down. So if we close this a bit more, the middle valve, which is our balancing valve, we will then notice that the temperature will start to go down. So now we're going back towards 120. After you make an adjustment with the valve, wait a few minutes to make sure that, see where the needle goes. Because you want to make sure that no matter what, it's above 110 degrees on the inlet side. So now we're dropping below 120, we're getting close to 115 again. Anything above 110 is fine, but wait a few minutes to make sure that you don't have the valve too closed or too open and that it's at least a above 110 but less than 125. 